February is National Bird Feeding Month, and it can be an entertaining and educational use of your backyard. Uh, and also it gives us a chance to see birds and learn about them up close. And that's a, a big part, I think, of the positive effect of feeders is for all of us, even in urban and suburban environments, to be able to connect with and get to see different bird species up close, watch their behavior and how they interact, and maybe find a love of birds through that close contact. New York enjoys quite a variety of birds through the winter months, including colorful cardinals and blue jays, as well as Carolina wrens, woodpeckers, and the clever nuthatchers. So they'll grab seeds from the feeder and then bring it back to a tree while they'll stash it in crevices in the bark for later. So those guys can be clever. Not only are they getting the bonus food, but they're saving some for seconds later. The birds need a replacement for the insects they eat in the summer months. Uh, so accessing uh, high energy, high protein, high fat foods can be important. So nuts and seeds are common. Sunflower seeds are one of the most popular. Bird feeders come in all sizes and designs, but location is the most important aspect. And what you want to do is locate them where there's some open space so that birds on the feeder can see their way around and keep an eye out for predators, but also with a few potential perches nearby so that when they arrive, they can do a little bit of reconnaissance to perch, look around, make sure it feels like a safe spot before they begin to feed. Even though bird watching is your goal, avoid putting feeders too close to a window. That can lead to serious accidents. So if the only location is near a window, take precautions. You want to make sure you mark that window with some decals that help prevent the birds from accidentally colliding into our windows, which is not what we want as an outcome from our bird feeder. Finally, don't forget about water. Water is sometimes overlooked, but that's a very limited resource in the winter. Birds need water not only to drink, but also to bathe, and it's important for them to be able to bathe to properly maintain their feathers, which help keep them warm in the winter.